Smallfoot from Warner Brothers Pictures, Animated Pictures, uh, released September 21st, 2018, directed by Carrie Kirkpatrick, who's also done, like, Over the Hedge, uh, Imagine That, Chicken Run, a few others. This had a budget of $80 million, and it made $214 million at the box office. This is an interesting animated film. Basically, your Channing Tatum plays, uh, a yeti there's this big colony of yetis that live on this mountain and uh they don't think humans exist and they follow like these stones sort of like there's ancient scrolls or whatever um type folklore and uh humans are a myth to them and basically he sees one and uh gets to know one and then you they don't believe him so he, they banish him down and he ends up bringing them back and uh Trying to get, convince them that humans exist. And uh, in turn, the humans also trying to convince the humans that yetis exist. And that there's a huge colony of them. It's a pretty neat concept. How they basically just flipped everything from like... Mo everyone would be like... Majority of people are like Bigfoot doesn't exist. Like there's a handful of believers and stuff. And it's basically this but told from a yeti's perspective. Which is actually pretty cool. Um... There is a lot of good funny scenes in it. It's great for the whole family. Uh, very amusing. And the story is very moving. And uh, yeah. I thought it was actually pretty well done. The only big gripe about this is. It's your typical family animated film. Uh, so there's nothing really new to the table. It's more like the same structure as a standard family film. Like they have a conflict with your main characters. And, uh, they basically just try to resolve it. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's a little generic. And, uh, another big problem I had with this movie is the music is awful. I thought, like, I, I get they're trying to be, uh, have, like, some musical parts of, like, Disney and stuff. But this did not take the cake. It, this is basically just a ripoff of, like, other popular pop songs. Nothing really original or written just for the film. Um, but overall, I thought the story was well done. The voice acting was cool. Some of the choices were a little weird, I thought, but overall, it was a decent flick. Um, yeah, Warner, Warner Animation is stepping their game up. I heard their film Storks is really good. I might have to check that out, um, too. But, uh, they're getting up there with Disney and, uh, all the other big animated companies with animation. And... Warner animation stuff's always better than the elimination shit, so yeah. Smallfoot is a good film. Besides the music being too cheesy and stuff. Now I'm a metalhead, so obviously I'm not gonna like the music, but uh most people will probably find it acceptable. So don't if you're if you like pop music and stuff, I'm pretty sure you wouldn't have a problem with it. Just be prepared that there's nothing really new. Some of the jokes fall flat, but overall it's still a good humbling experience. There's some good funny jokes in there too, and overall it's just a decent, good, fill, entertaining time to pass an hour and a half. So definitely throw this one on. It's on Netflix right now, so definitely give it a go. It is actually pretty fun. If I was going to rate this, I'm going to give this one a 4 out of 5. Um, yeah, so definitely check it out. Charlie's link down below, like always. My Instagram's linked down below too. I post clips of films, every type of film I watch, and uh, that I'm going to review in the future on my story. So make sure you follow me there if you want to stay in it. Also look for the hashtag with the title name. I put it small and hide it in the uh, in the film clip. So make sure uh, you look for that because that will be the next film I'm reviewing. So yeah, definitely follow me on Instagram. Also, like this video, share this video if you really want to. Um, yeah, comment down below if you've seen this. Let me know what you thought. Did you and your family love this film? Uh, did you absolutely hate it and thought it was awful? I'd love to hear about it. If you have other films that you want to hear my opinions on, comment those down below too. I'll review anything. So even if you comment Barney or Elmo or anything like that, I'll probably sit through it and give you the review. So yeah, if you want to make torture me. Go for it. Comment down below. Also, make sure you subscribe because you never know what I'm going to talk about next. I know I talk a lot about horror and sci-fi, but I like these family movies every now and then. So, yeah. But Smallfoot's a pretty good movie. There's not much to complain about. And, yeah, not much else to say. I just say go watch it. It's a fun time. So, that, 
Uh, another family film in the books, but I don't know what the hell I'm going to review next. So we'll just have to see in the next one. So I'll see you there.